Plastic Man. Plastic Man. That's amazing. No. I've never heard of a Plastic Man before. I've heard of a Rubber Man, but never a Plastic Man. Yeah, I'm not sure if that's really a statement of how tough he is, or maybe just um, how recyclable. Hard to say. That could be. I'm, I'm guessing that someone in the gym gave him that name, and I don't know where it came from. You don't know anything about uh, Sam? You know, I know nothing about hardly any of the guys that fight out of Boone other than down in Boone, they fight a lot. Shannon Scott is fighting out of Damage Inc, which is a. We got some tough kids that are fighting out of there, so they got, I think, we got four fighters coming out of there tonight. So, uh, it should, should be tough, so we'll see what happens with the plastic man here. So, is um, Damage Inc., is that the same school that um, uh, Adam uh, McDonough is from? Well? Absolutely. So that is a pretty tough crowd, huh? Yeah, those guys are brawlers, they're rollers, and they do cardio, and uh, they got talent, and they're not afraid to give in anything, but so we'll see what they got. Of course, we have our resident uh, CFX uh, referee. <laughs> Mr. Fred Ennish, the legend, indeed. There you go. Night begins. Oh, some aggression right after comes that. out swinging. Goes right for a guillotine choke. Looks like uh, it's hard to see there. Is the arm in or out? I really can't tell. If I would to guess, I'd say the arm is in. Yeah, it looks like it probably is. Horrible camera work. Yes, indeed. We're at the cut someone up and get him to get a different angle. I think. Okay, looks. Oh, there's no arm in. Yeah, looks like the arm is not in, so. That's deep. This could be a very short one. But it looks like. Uh, it looks like Sam is fighting the hands. Uh, he's peeling it off, he's doing what he's supposed to do here. And a little more shoulder pressure would do wonders, but uh, so far so good. And, and actually, Shannon should really be pushing back, but there it goes. Okay, Sam's out. So he's transitioning to an arm bar. Going to use the cage. Yeah. Pop captured the arm. And it's definitely going for the submissions here. Looks like Sam's doing the right thing. Kind of crushing him up, but oh, he's getting straightened out. Getting extended, yeah. Hard to finish that when you're up against the cage. Yeah, I mean, the cage is kind of a bugger sometimes. And it works for you, something that works against you. It looks like he's gonna get it though. He's slowly getting extended. He's getting himself away from the cage. Oh, oh shit, that's a mistake. There we go. Goes. It's over. Those guys, I'm not sure, even hit each other. No, Good just that one swing and a miss from the beginning. Good ground work. So are uh, the Damage Inc. guys uh, usually considered submission submission guys? Or? You know, they're they're fairly well-rounded. They do a little bit of this and a little bit of that. and uh, Mixed martial arts? They are. They would be considered a typical mixed martial arts. It was a well-fought match. Now our big Papa Schnockies coming in with uh, the... Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together. Somebody make some noise for these two men. 
Representing Damage Incorporated, sponsored by Wingnut Tattoo, Shannon Scott! Shannon Scott with an impressive submission win. Good for him. Hope to see him more often. Knights off of the back.